as partners in life as well as finances it is important for couples to understand that they'll have several joint goals once they plan for this they have a clear communication about this and they start executing that plan it will also help relationships grow be more stable and have less disputes i'm going to talk about some of the common joint goals that couples have and how we can plan for this the first goal i would recommend is to build an emergency fund when an emergency occurs we don't want to be caught flat footed by it that is not the time to be discussing who will contribute how much towards such an emergency we should already have these funds in place typically in stable instruments like fixed deposits or short term debt funds that give us stable returns and are easily liquidatable so this helps us tide over any emergency another goal that is common these days post pandemic is traveling many more people are traveling and for couples this could be important as it helps them break out of the usual routine and look forward to something more exciting since travel is usually a short term goal something that we do within a year or two these also can be placed in stable instruments maybe each of the partners can contribute a certain amount every month and that fund will build over time and can be used purely for travel purposes one of the most significant milestones that any couple can achieve is buying a house together this requires a lot of planning and budgeting there are two parts to purchasing a home one is putting a down payment second is to take a mortgage to finance the rest of the payment building this down payment itself is a sizable task as usually the amount is quite high there normally the time frame for building this down payment is 3 to 5 years away and hence you can look at a mixture of stable instruments as well as a little more risky instruments which give you higher return so a blend of fixed deposits and mutual funds could work well in this kind of situation for building the down payment amount when you take a mortgage it's not like any other saving because here the emi has to be paid monthly you don't have the luxury of stopping it for a few months and restarting it so couples have to be careful that each partner is clear on how much they are contributing and that they will contribute to this for a long period of time planning for children's education is also a big task especially for their college education many times it happens that in our normal routine we tend to focus on their immediate studies and after a few years we see college fees are looming up but if we plan sips into mutual funds at an early age and keep adding to this then it will help us set up a fund for college we can easily find out what is the fees for the type of education that we want to provide them at college level then we can figure out what is the education inflation and the impact on the fees so if my child is 5 years old and they're going to go to college at 18 years old i have to figure out how much will the fees increase in 12 to 13 years time then i can work backwards and start an sip to fund this educational fees but this could be put into longer term instruments like mutual funds or a portion of it can be allocated to stocks as well where the yield is higher and it has a long time horizon another joint goal which couples can plan for is retirement once we stop working we still want to maintain the lifestyle that we had over the working years this also signifies a deeper level of commitment at this point of time each partner contributing to a joint life post retirement is a way of saying that they committed for the long run here you can bring in different instruments such as mutual funds shares real estate investments trusts and other instruments that you're comfortable with as you are aware each of these instruments come with their own risk so it's important to understand how these function and how they can help to build you a long term portfolio so as we bring all these goals together we are weaving these dreams and goals into a plan which will help us ride out the years smoothly it reduces the number of disputes that we have with our partner 
it helps us commit for the long term and it helps us lead a happier life together as a couple. So do share your thoughts as well as any other inquiries that you have about these joint goals and we'll be happy to reach out to you. You can also reach out to us in the comment section with any specific queries and we'll be happy to answer it.